Good morning, guys and girls. Welcome, everybody. So, I'm wearing a mask today, mostly to show off. Look at this. This lovely mask was made for me by my girlfriend, Katarina, last night. The reason I'm wearing a mask, as whilst in the woods, as you can see, is because we're in the woods and we're trying to meet people. Now, specifically, Beatopia has organized an event for the autumn break, the autumn school break. So it's now half past 11 in about half an hour. We're hoping some people will turn up and we're gonna show you what we're doing today. So let's go for a little tour. We have all of our equipment here and this is where we will have the fire on which everyone can cook. <laughs> and then coming over here, we have Jacob from Beatopia yes. and Beatopia. Mohammed also from Beatopia. So as you can see, these guys are gloriously dressed up in their furs. Look at that. Yes. Very good. So they will be sat over here. Yes. In the storytelling tent. Now let's have a look at what they've got going on. Yes. <laughs> well, so the plan for today is that I will be mainly presiding over the stories. And what we'll be telling stories about are mammals found in Upland. So we will be telling stories about actually the, now it is the five species we have brought skulls for here. We'll tell tales of the red deer, of the roe deer, and we'll also tell stories about the lynx, the bear, and the wolf. Excellent, good. That is the stories we will tell here. That's perfect. So that's Jacob and Mohammed. Yeah. And then if you follow me over here, we're yes. going to go we're to... Gonna, we're going to follow you around. We have another fire pit over here. Let's show, do that first. Spin the camera again. So we have another fire pit here. Here we will be doing fire lighting skills with kids of different ages. Precisely. Yeah. So we so, will focus on teaching kids how to light a fire with uh, fire starters, uh, matches, if you're a little bit more beginner and we will show you different tips and tricks how to do it easily even in actually such a wet weather as we're having right now absolutely because there are ways and we will be trying to teach uh, how you'll always get a nice warm fire going absolutely so it is awesome it is a little bit wet and then we come down here to the final stage of our <laughs> tasks we have another tarp set up in these trees and I need to flip the camera again this is getting complicated right here we go <laughs> so it doesn't look like much yet but this will be our craft zone in the craft zone we will be making dream catchers we will be playing with knives we will be doing whatever green woodcraft we can think of in the woods but I want to show you one last thing so this is the site it's glorious it's beautiful and let me just show you the pièce de résistance, the beauty of it. Let's see if I can get this camera to actually look at me. There's my boys. Hey. <laughs> so, whenever you come to this site, which is... Ba -da -da -ba. <laughs> Veres, it's called, come here and look for the wild water. It's called the wild water. Here, right here, you have the sign. This is the signs to look for. Mm -hmm. Yep, we've got posters. Look at that beautiful sight. <laughs> We've seen all kinds of birds running around. We're looking for mammals. We're looking for everything. Yeah. So, we're all here. <laughs> and we're yeah. excited for you guys to join us soon. Yeah. <laughs> Catch you soon. <laughs>